photographing these women that are, are up. We, I think the oldest woman we photographed was 90, 92? 93. 93. And photographing these women who are still stripping today and willing to strip for the camera is a really incredible thing because well, uh, personally I found it really inspiring because it it just rubbishes a lot of your idea of aging when you when you talk to them there's lots of complex issues about aging but the fact that they're still brave enough to stand on stage in their pasties and their and their g-strings I think is a is a really inspiring thing and, and, and like subversive too and uh, but yeah very subversive yeah because it really bumps up uh, literally and figuratively against our preconceptions about aging women's bodies and how they are supposed to be displayed yeah uh, ultimately I think probably the biggest thing is that you feel that they're so brave mm -hmm. It was also very much based on a, a trusting relationship that they built up with Matilda. You know, first she would photograph them performing and then she moved into more kind of intimate situations with them, like in their homes or, or portraits. Yeah, they really led us into their lives with both the text and opening their homes and their scrapbooks mm -hmm. and their wardrobes for us to go and take photos of and, and making surprisingly bold choices in how they wanted to be photographed, which reflected, I suppose, their, their boldness in taking to the stage.